Hey everybody and welcome back to Noisy Works. Today we have actually something cool and new from uh, Polymaker. This is going to be your own filament dryer, an active one, not just like you have now the desiccant version. Yes, yeah, so the current one we have is a poly box and uh, it doesn't actively dry. You can uh, print from it, but there's no uh, heating element. There's no fans in it, just desiccant. Yep. And um, this is our solution to uh, print, dry and store your uh, filament. So if I have it right, you have one central unit right over here. Yes. This is going to dry everything that you put in these boxes and they just sit on top like this. Like this. Yes. You dry them and then you set them apart and you have a nice little box with a display right over here with some desiccants. Yes, so the idea is for the user to have uh, multiple boxes and one unit. So you uh, say you uh, want to print your nylon spool and it's been left out for, for a while and it's become wet. Then you, uh, you put it in, you dry it and then you can store it and then you can still print from it, of course, from a, from a separate box. But then you, when you want to print another uh, spool, then you can dry that one and you can have a multiple uh, uh, storage solution. Not only that, you actually have another great solution for these boxes because everything you put on the table is really expensive real estate. Yes, yeah. You have something to put on the wall, yeah. which is free so, real estate, um, basically. Yes, yeah, so we've designed a few files uh, to make it easier to store the boxes. You can hang the, uh, the potty box and um, yeah, you can uh, make a row of uh, potty boxes or yeah. you probably sort your uh, potty box. And of course you can still print while, it, uh, while it's stored on the wall. I can see we have actual roller bearings and we have a metal rod. Yes. So everything runs nice and smoothly. It uh, runs very smoothly, yes. And we also have a little tube in the middle. This yeah. is probably going to be for smaller spools then. Yeah, if you want to print a smaller spool, then it'd be, uh, then we advise to, uh, to put it on the, uh, the roller in the middle. So removing is actually really easy. Just pull the tab and you can remove the complete box to dry it again or put the new one in like this and then you slide this thing back into it and now it's hanging nicely on the wall. So right now there is no official pricing for this system. Okay, so we have our first look of the Polymaker uh, actual dryer. The poly dryer. The poly dryer. Yes. And uh, I'm looking forward to review the system. You can expect a full teardown of this thing as usual. And guys, I hope to see you in the next one.